एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल लर्न आईटी टुडे सेशन इज ऑल अबाउट वैंकूवर रिलीज फीचर्स दैट वर इंट्रोड्यूस्ड इन सर्विस नाउ सो इफ यू आर न्यू टू द चैनल प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माय चैनल लर्न आईटी प्लीज वॉच माय वीडियोस टिल द एंड फॉर कंप्लीट इंफॉर्मेशन सो व्हाट फीचर आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस टुडे इज रीडिजाइंड एप्लीकेशन मैनेजर सो नाउ लेट्स सी हाउ आवर रीडिजाइंड एप्लीकेशन मैनेजर लुक्स लाइक so we will type here plugins so i will click on plugin here and you will see the new redesigned application manager where you can see your applications and plugins together on this view so you can see this view looks really good and you can find the way how you can search your applications or plugins installed in the system and here you can see there are lot of details under this application manager where we can install update and manage licensed applications and plugins for our instance right so now you can see we have a request plugin button so if we click on this request plugin we can request the plugin from hi support and here there is a link open store where we can open the store.servicenow.com from uh, this button all right and now you can see there is a ui uh, displayed here just like a dashboard where you can see the store applications family plugins and the service now products right and you can directly install or check the updates related to your plugins or applications all right suppose i will click on plugin so you will see lot of plugins started displaying here right so if i click on this plugin so let's see what happens so now you can see there are details coming on here technical details so currently this uh, devops util only have these details it will access global scope items from within devops scopes right so similar way you can install your application and you can see all the details uh, related to that plugins so for example if i take uh, other plugins where you can find lot of details suppose this is a performance analytics here you can see there is a information like uh, this is related to major incident management or whatever it is related to so you can see performance analytics content pack for mim so here we can install this plugin and you can see this is the different view previously there was other view displaying when we were opening the plugins so now this this ui is really very good and the older version we were seeing it from longer days so i think that was a good uh, change which was done in the vancouver release so suppose i will click on install button so you can see what happens here so you can see we have dependent plugins started displaying here and you can see there are more details are started displaying here we can click on install now and install later so this ui has also changed right so if we click on install button and now you will see our uh, the plugin is started installation and i will show you what information has been displayed after the install of this plugin so now you can see our plugin has been installed here and now you will see the view detail button is displayed here i will click on this view details and you can see lot more details started displaying here when it was in, uh, like uh, the plugin was installed and here are the activation details what are the activation logs plugin files and customized files all right so these are the version details of uh, 1.0.0 and here are the activation logs and plugins files and here we will be able to see the update details whether the changes is applied skipped processed or unchanged whatever details is uh, added so you can see all the details started displaying here all right so here are the activation details plugin files so you can see more detailed version of the plugins which you are installing right so this is the application manager how it's look like all right so now if you click on request plugin it will redirect to support.servicenow.com and if you click on store open store button and it will redirect to store.servicenow.com all right 
and if you click on this switch to classic app manager it will redirect to our old application manager so you can see we are now back to our old application manager so this ui is older ones and new one looks quite good so you if you see there is a new button here as well try new app manager if you will click on this you will redirect to our redesigned application manager all right so this is all about one of the feature uh, which were introduced in vancouver release all right so please provide your comment if you have any questions doubts or queries related to this session for more information please visit the description section under this video thanks for hearing me out stay tuned for more videos please do like share and subscribe to my channel learn it